Hi, it's Michael here. Just wanted to give you some tips on how to use your online gallery. Now, if you've purchased a um, digital package where you're getting X number of digital files in addition to your session, you can go into your uh, gallery here and you could submit those as favorites. As you see, as I roll over each image, we get a little heart symbol and a little shopping cart down the lower right hand side. The heart symbol is the way to pick your favorites and that's the best way to submit the images that you want as part of your digital package. So if I wanted this as a favorite, I just click a heart on it. I go to this one, I want this as a favorite, I click a heart on it and so on. So that's if you've pre-purchased a digital package. If you're looking at prints, there are a number of different options. Again, let's come up to this one and we can click on the shopping cart um, icon and then it pulls up we have prints we can purchase additional digital images for example if you have a digital image package that includes 20 digital images but you know you really found two more that you want you can add those on as additional purchases to your package um, you can do wall portraits through here so we can scroll down and say we want a 16 by 24 gallery wrap canvas we've got that we can add that to the cart now let's say we wanted to do um, some gift prints for grandma or aunts and uncles and such. We do offer a bundle of those. So if we can go into packages here, we have a small print and bundle where you can get five prints, five eight by 10 prints or five five by seven prints. And those can be a mixture of different poses. So let's go to the small print bundle, the eight by tens we add to the cart and then now we pick which images we want to have as our five eight by tens so I can go in and say I want that one I want to add more images I want to come down here if I want a different image click on add more images and say I want this one click on the cart add that one in add more images and now where do I go because I've got this image up you come up here to the left hand corner, you click on that icon, and then now we see all the different images again. And I want to add this one in as an 8x10. Boom. Got that one in. Add more images. I want this one. Add that in as an 8x10. Add more images. Again, I'm stuck on this image. Nope. Come up here to the left hand corner, and you can go back to the main screen that shows everything. And then let's add this one in as our last 8 by 10. Now we can go and view cart. So we can see that's everything that's in there. We've got the one for the 16 by 20 gallery wrap canvas. And then we've got our small print bundle, which I'll be able to sort out when you submit your order. So let's back out of this. What other things can we do in here? Um, we can go in and we can do, let's see, let's grab this one. We'll add this to the cart. We'll go back out of packages and we can go into products. In products, we do have our popular storyboard wood block. That's a 25 inch by 22 inch dimensional wood block storyboard. It's got one large image. It's about 15 by 19 for the large image. And then it has three accent images that are all six by six squares. I point that out that they're square, so make sure that the accent images you're picking are items that can be cropped as squares. So let's add this to our cart. And this shows an example here on the right hand side what that looks like. Now, let's say your main image is a horizontal image that you want to use. These can rotate. So we can rotate this counterclockwise and we could put your main image as a horizontal image on the top of this with the accent images underneath. So add that to cart. We're going to add images. So we're adding this in as an image. We need to add more images. So what are our other accent images? Again, to go back to the main gallery, click up here in the left-hand corner. And let's say we want to add this one. And that adds in. And then go back here. And let's add this one. And I had accidentally clicked out of the storyboard wood block. I can cl click back in because it said incomplete. Boom, add that one in. And I'm going to add in my, whoop, yeah, let's close that one. See, I made a mistake. 
So I was going to put two of those in. I want to add more images. See, I'm making mistakes on purpose so you can see the best way of doing this. Of course I did that on purpose. I wouldn't have just made a silly mistake on my own. Add this in, and then now these are the four images for the storyboard wood block. What I will do is I will likely be in touch with you to see if you have any preference on which image goes where on the wood block. We've got the main image, and then we've got three accent images. If you leave it up to me, I'm going to make sure it looks great because I will work with the images and move them back and forth to make sure that we have a good visual flow. But if you want some input on that, please let me know and we can work through and I can even do a rough design if you need me to. So we can continue shopping. And what other things do we have in here? Let's go back to the main thing and let's grab this image. Now what if we want to have this as a digital image and we've already maybe done the senior deluxe images and and we've picked all those as our favorites but we want to add an additional one we can do that too we can add this in this is above and beyond the digital image that are included in your prepaid package so we have a lot of options for you to do online of course if you have any questions pick up the phone give me a call send me an email happy to work through everything and if we need to jump into a zoom call and work through the that's fine too but I like to use this online gallery because I think it's convenient for people. It means you could do this at 6 o'clock in the morning and do it at 11 o'clock at night, whenever it's convenient for you to go through and pick the images that you want. And then if you want to follow up with a meeting or an online Zoom meeting, we can do that as well. So hopefully that helps. Hopefully that clears things up, makes it a little bit easier for you. And happy, uh, happy good luck <laughs> picking your images.